Good Thursday evening, Southeast Texas. Uh, looking at today's allergy report, everything is down today. So hopefully that'll leave you breathing a little better. Dry weather expected Friday. At this point, we'll go to 50% coverage of uh, scattered showers and thunderstorms. Could get nasty coming up uh, Saturday night, depending upon the front. Then dry weather expecting Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday of next week. A few showers back in the forecast by Wednesday and Thursday. As far as temperatures, a little bit of a warm up coming up Friday and Saturday, then cooler than normal temperatures coming up Sunday, Monday and closer to normal by Wednesday of next week ahead of a warm up by late next week. So the big picture shows upper level low pressure, which brought us to scattered showers and thunder showers yesterday is pulling away from our area and some dry air filtering on in. That's why we saw fewer showers today, only an isolated shower. Moisture coming in from the southwest will give us partly cloudy skies coming up. So a ridge of high pressure, and you see it right there, will be over us tomorrow. So dry weather expected. We're watching this next trough of low pressure that will be moving across the northern plains. That will drag a cold front into our area coming up Saturday night in southeast Texas. So tonight, though, looking at uh, skies becoming mostly clear, another chilly night across the area as we'll see temperatures dropping into the mid-50s in the lakes area and the upper 50s to lower 60s in the triangle. Tomorrow, partly cloudy skies are expected. No rain as temperatures rise into the lower 80s due to suddenly winds off the Gulf of Mexico. Speaking of the Gulf of Mexico, looking at slightly choppy seas around two feet tomorrow. A south wind at 10 to 15 knots expected. High tides at Sabine Pass at 118 p.m. and 945 p.m. Our forecast tonight's a cool one. You don't need a jacket in the morning. Mid 50s lakes, upper 50s to near 60, maybe the lower 60s in the triangle with light south winds. Tomorrow, partly cloudy, dry and warmer with highs in the lower 80s as south winds take hold. So Friday's a keeper. Saturday, we're expecting scattered showers, maybe a few thunderstorms during the afternoon. And then as we head towards Saturday night, we'll be watching the potential for a line of showers and storms to be headed in our area as a front approaches southeast Texas. After that uh, marginal risk of severe weather uh, pushes through, we'll see a nice cool down coming up on Sunday. It'll be a windy day with lower humidity. And then as we head towards, say, Monday morning, look at that, upper 40s lakes and uh, maybe the lower 50s in the triangle. So jackets and coats coming up back to, yeah, back to that business coming up Monday morning. Another chilly morning on Tuesday. Highs will be in the lower, I should say, upper 70s with clouds on the increase Tuesday. And then as we head on in to, say, uh, the middle to latter part of uh, the week, we're looking at a uh, slight chance of showers across southeast Texas. Next cold front uh, on Friday, there may not be that much cooling with it. And in fact, it looks like there's a potential it may not even make it. Regardless, we warm back up into the mid 80s by late next week. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Download our app. And as always, there's more weather at 12newsnow.com. Stay safe and have a fantastic Thursday night.